Moody Air Force Base packing their bags this weekend, now traveling to Texas in the military aircraft you just saw on your screen. They're deploying to help storm victims. Our Nolani Matthews talks to Moody officials about their rescue efforts and why they mean so much to so many. Moody Airmen packing for another deployment, taking off during a time of desperate need. This time, that mission on U.S. soil, helping trap civilians hundreds of miles away in East Texas. This wing participated in, in Hurricane Katrina. Uh, we hadn't seen anything quite at that scope and scale, but I think this emergency is, is rapidly approaching that, if not exceeding it. I've been able to see them and hear them all throughout the day multiple times doing rescues. I've just honestly, I've never seen anything like it. Rachel Scaff is from Valdosta. Her home in southeast Houston, now barely recognizable. How many people there are that are stranded in their homes, aren't able to get anywhere, it's just unreal. Witnessing the historic damage just outside her front door. It honestly seems like something you would see on a movie. It's just awful. Now holding on to positive thoughts like the efforts of these Moody Airmen, rescuing families from rising flood waters there. We're in the business of saving lives. So whether when we get an opportunity to save American lives and to and to roll in and support, you know, citizens of our own country, it's that much more special and our guys are really amped to go. Both crossing paths and proving this a small world with good people, sending relief in times of tragedy. In that Austin, Nolani Matthews, WCTV, Eyewitness News. And Moody says, of course, they're just one piece yeah. of a very large uh, rescue mission.